Hey guys, welcome back to my channel or welcome if you're new. Today we are going to be making chili and the ingredients that you're going to need is one pound of ground beef, a half of a small onion, a mild chili seasoning mix, garlic, prego or whatever spaghetti sauce you would like. We have prego, three cheese, bay leaves, hot chili beans, a can of tomato sauce, that's a 29 ounce can. Italian seasoning, onion powder, black pepper, Worcestershire sauce, slap your mama, garlic powder, jerk seasoning, total seasoning, and sugar. Let's get started. So first things first, we are going to ground our pound of ground beef. So we're going to put that into a hot skillet. And go ahead and brown that up. We're going to brown this up. And then to this, we are going to add just a little bit of total seasoning. And while that is browning, we will chop our onion. You can also add bell pepper to this, but my kids don't like bell pepper, so I'm not adding any in. I'm just going to do just like a rough chop on the onions. They're going to cook down. So. You can also make this in a crock pot like I am, or you can make this on the stove, and it will probably take about 30 to 45 minutes to actually cook in the pot on the stove. So we're going to cook our eyes on low all day for about 6 to 8 hours. We're just going to add the onions right to the meat. Alright, so I'll be right back once I have the rest of these onions chopped up. Now that we have the onions all chopped up, we are going to just combine this with the ground beef. And so this bowl, we're going to add our can of hot chili beans. And we're going to pour them into a bowl, juices and all. And we're going to mash them a bit. My kids don't like beans, but this is how I sneak them in. I leave some whole, but mash the majority of them. So I'll come back once the ground beef is cooked and I have the 
beans all mashed and ready to go. All right, so the ground beef is cooked and we drained it. So now we're gonna put that into our crock pot. And again, I always use a crock pot liner for easy cleanup. Then we are going to add our beans and this is how the beans look. I smush majority of them, but I like to leave some whole for me. So I'm just gonna add all of that in there. We're gonna add our can of tomato sauce. entire can and we like our chili on the thinner side so we're gonna put our can of prego in there as well we're gonna add our Worcestershire sauce I'll say about a fourth of a cup we are going to Empty our contain our packet of mild chili seasoning in here for the whole thing. Then with our seasoning, total seasoning, we're gonna add more of that. And how much seasoning you add is your preference. Italian seasoning. We are going to add two to three bay leaves in our chili. Garlic, we're gonna we're gonna do three three squeezes, so about three tablespoons of this. You can also use fresh garlic if you like. I'll say three to four cloves. We're gonna add garlic powder. We're gonna add some jerk seasoning and that's just gonna be for a little spice. Regular pepper. Onion powder. And some slap your mama. Just a little of this. And for sugar, we are going to add about that much. So we're gonna give this a stir. all combined all right so we're gonna put our lid onto the crock pot and we're gonna cook this on low for about six to eight hours or you can cook it on high for about four to five so I will come back when it's all done and I'll plate up a bowl all right so this is the finished product let me just show you how the consistency of the chili and then over here we have the finished product i just topped it with some cheddar cheese and sour cream and we're gonna have some crackers so go ahead like comment and subscribe and i'll see you in our next video